All right, so there is a great event coming up this weekend. It is the Butterfly Blessings Down Syndrome Walk coming up. And uh, in the studio is here with us. Is, by the way, it's this Sunday in yeah. South Point. And we are joined by Tina Irwin, who is here once again with her son, JC, who has really cool glasses on, and Tara Tomlin, and Colton. Her son, Colton, is here. Colton's this year's Grand Marshal for the parade, so that's even better. So How exciting. Thanks for stopping by. You guys must be really excited about the event. Yes, we are. Thank you for having us. A lot of work, though, has oh, yeah. been put into it. Yes, a lot of work and a lot of planning, as usual. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And um, we're going to have inflatables, and we'll have a lot of vendors there uh -huh. selling their goods to bring extra extra money, oh, <laughs> and um, just a lot just a lot of fun and just exposure for yeah. people with Down syndrome for everybody. Exposure and fundraising. Fundraising right. is the fundraising. key here. Yes. You mentioned the money. That's that's the that is that's the whole point of what we're doing here is to try to raise funds. Yes, um, we're a newly established nonprofit called Butterfly Blessings, mm -hmm. um, just for our local area. Mm -hmm. Um, for Down syndrome support for families locally here. Mm -hmm. This is actually some of the video from last oh, year. Oh, yeah, here we go, yeah. Oh, oh, those are some of the nice pictures that came out. I love that. Okay, so, I mean, this is obviously a message that's near and dear to both of your hearts. Um, there was actually a sign on one of the pictures you sent to us that says, my extra chromosome makes me extra special. Let's talk about that. Do you want to? Yeah. Go ahead, Tara. Tell us what you think about that, yeah. Um, well, I think that, you know, he's extra sweet, extra mm -hmm. cuddly, he's loves to snuggle. He's extra shy right now with the cameras <laughs> yeah. around, I think, yeah. Yes. It's just extra love. Mm -hmm. yeah. And, yeah, they may do things a little differently or so. take them a little longer to accomplish something, yeah. but they can do it. Right. And that's the main uh, message we'd like to get out, that different is normal and it's okay. Yeah. And you, you see, and that's the thing. As parents, you see the development of your children. You can, you see that, uh, you know. And so, for parents who say, "Oh, I feel so sorry for you," you get, you get a lot of that. I know you get a lot. Of, yes. Oh, I feel so sorry for you. And people, my sister, she, she taught children with Down syndrome for, for years, and she said the parents were always like. Whatever that we we are absolutely so enthralled with our kids, and you get to see the development. Can you talk about how your children have changed just over the last? I mean, just in a year, just over the last couple of years. Oh yes. Well, by age three, JC wasn't walking. He's had a lot of bowel surgeries, so his core was compromised. Oh. So. Um, around four years old, uh -huh. just let go of his handicap walker and took off. Wow. Um, just uh, language-wise and skills, he's uh, just over the past year, he's yep. signing more, communicating more, um, becoming more verbal as yeah. well. Yeah. He'll, yes, he he'll get there talking eventually, you know. Um, we just learned everything is on his time frame, mm -hmm. and right. we just yep. don't sweat it. It's going to happen, you know, eventually. Yeah. Right. Yeah, and point. I think that's the thing that, that uh, parents have to hang in there. And there is a lot of patience required there, isn't there? Yes, there is a lot of patience, and that is something I learned after he was born. I didn't, I was not a patient person before then. Oh, so you weren't a patient person. <laughs> no, but I've definitely learned patience, and, you know, it's, it's well worth it. Yeah, that was part of my question, too. I mean, how have they changed you personally, too? Well, you answered good that. Good question, yeah. yeah. Um, changed me tremendously. Um, I appreciate the moments more. Mm -hmm. You know, I've already raised three children that are in their 20s now, okay. and I felt like we rushed through life, and I wish I had went back. If I could go back, I would cherish all those small moments more. Mm -hmm. And it's a blessing through JC that we get to do that. So yeah. that's fantastic. Yeah, I mean, that's another good way to look at it is that it's the patience that you're learning, but also the patience to love every moment. Yeah. Because they are so special, they really are. Yeah. Yeah, and, and this, the whole idea about why people can attend or, or should attend, is obvious because it's a, it's a fundraiser for a terrific cause. Right. Um, so, t talk about why people should attend. You personally, if you had a chance to, to to sit down with somebody and say, "Well, why should I even be there?" What would be your personal message to them? And I guess it's not too late to. No, to not register. too late. You can register. Okay. That day of as well. Oh, cool. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we'll yeah. be there by 10 a.m. So you can come and register anytime mm -hmm. between 10 and 1. And um, I, it's important because locally, you know, like when I had JC, we didn't know he had Down syndrome until after he was born. Okay. And then you're throwing a bunch of information, but you don't really know where resources are. You don't know who to contact for things. Sure. And just by us, you know, Community-wise, yeah. and parents getting together and exchanging information yep. um, is is helpful. Okay. And uh, 
-hmm. So we're hoping in the next year to um, be able to get some more flyers and brochures yeah, and information absolutely. for people and then um, contacts with people for IEPs for school. Yeah. You know, just things you don't think about right. and then it comes up on you quickly and then you're like, oh no, you know, people don't know that what you can put in IEP per se yeah. or there's a special um, 504 plan if they have medical needs mm -hmm. you can do both or one or either you know stuff you don't know until sure so the know. event is essentially a great place to also network and get support from other people too right? yes okay yeah and that's, that's key that's for parents right. who are looking for support and obviously you need it I mean it's something yes. that you you have to do um, but at the same time here you are doing this and and here you are also, you have to be moms, you have to be wives, you have to be parents of other kids, and that's 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 part of the challenge. But having people to help you must yeah. be a tremendous thing. Having that that that, yes. that network. That network. Yeah, I that found network. Tara and I lean on each other quite a bit lately. You yes. know, and yeah. if you just need to vent, or if you need information on how to get a reference, a referral to a specialist, or yeah. anything, you know, yep. you can call around and. And so this is the reason for this group mm -hmm. to get started is so we can have one place where people can contact and we can help in that way. That's fantastic. We're honored to have you here. Yeah. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Thank you for coming in. It's, it's wonderful. All right. So let's go over the details one more time. The Buddy Walk is this Sunday from 1 to 5 p.m. at the South Point High School Stadium. That's easy to get to. Yeah. yeah. If you have any questions, of course, um, you can reach them. You guys ha have a Facebook page? Is Butterfly Blessings, okay. yes. Okay. And yes. then Butterfly Blessings Down Syndrome Walk is okay. the event. Wonderful. So you can search either one. Excellent. Great. We'll okay. post links Thank to both of those. Yeah. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Wonderful. All four of you. Yeah. Thanks, guys, you guys for coming in. Kisses, tell them bye. Thank you. you guys were terrific. Yeah. He took his As glasses. usual. <laughs> you want to tell them bye? You want to say bye bye? Oh, bye-bye. We get a high oh, five? Get a high five? We get a okay. high five. Okay. There you go. Perfect. Bye, Colton. Say bye-bye. Oh, Thanks for coming in. He's giving high fives now. Yeah, yeah. he's all got right. a good grip, too. Thank you all.